Welcome to the first ever hangout on the union budget. We got one more uh, question. This time it's a video question. And this is from Rishad Premji from Wipro. If you can play that question out for the finance minister. Good morning. My name is Rishad Premji, and I run strategy and M&A for the IT business of Wipro. Thank you for taking my question, Mr. Finance Minister, and congratulations on a well-balanced budget. I have two questions. The first is around the fiscal deficit, and wanted to get your commentary on how we stay on course from an execution standpoint, particularly given the challenges of an election year. The second question was around the current account deficit, and given the challenges and uh, volatility around the portfolio inflows, wanted to get your thoughts on alternative sources of financing that deficit if inflows were to dry up and liquidity was to dry up given the implications that it has on currency. Thank you for taking my questions. You're absolutely right. On the fiscal deficit, I've said, I've drawn these red lines. I will not cross them. I said it on my road shows uh, a couple of months ago in January. I've said it in the budget speech. I did not cross the red line for the current year. I shall not cross the red line for the next year. It will be kept at 4.8% or below. The current account deficit is more worrying. We have to actively woo the investor to India. Foreign direct investment, foreign institutional investment. We, we can do that by policies. And then we can do that by communicating our policies to the investor community. The policies are there in the budget speech more announcements will come from the regulators over the next uh, few days and weeks as they implement the announcements made in the budget speech. I expect the IRDA, the SEBI, and uh, in a limited way, the RBI to take some follow-up steps. After that, uh, I intend to travel uh, to the major financial centers. I've covered four already. I still have, would have to go to Tokyo, New York, Boston, Toronto, and I would have to visit some of the West Asian or Middle East countries to talk to them. There are sovereign funds, there are wealth funds, there are pension funds, university funds. We'd have to talk to these fund managers, and we need to keep this flow of money into India copious, uninterrupted, and adequate. There's a lot of hard work over the next 12 months, so I really can't sit back and say I've presented a budget and the work is over. There's a lot of hard work over the next few months. But I hope that we can find the resources to finance the current account deficit. But that's the, a short-term approach, or a short to medium-term approach. In the medium to long term, the only way and the right way to finance the current account deficit is to export. We have to export and pay for our imports. It's wrong to pay for your imports otherwise. So really, we'll have to get the export sector going. 